Hello on this fine day, this is Daniel G. Bennis, and I want to demonstrate some really cool antique technology. And to demonstrate, I've got Deanna's grandson, Mason, Logan, Miles, and hello, Ollie. All right, and right here are the antiques. These are field-ready uh, Bakelite phones. These are old, original, awesome phones. Okay, quick little note, um, a little research into these phones, and I found that they're actually from 1936, made by Siemens Company, and they, were world, they are uh, World War II phones. They were a little fragile for, with the Bakelite, and so they built wooden boxes around these, but these are actually from 1936. I was pretty blown away to find that out. Anyway, very cool. Now they have a set of bells on top of them. They have a giant Bakelite handle with a push-to-talk button. Sorry, I have a band-aid on my cut finger there. And then they have a crank right here, which generates high voltage, which sends a signal across these wires over to the other phone. This is a full duplex set. Well, it's not quite duplex, it's monoplex. Go ahead and hang it up. Go ahead and hang it up on the cradle. Okay, now we're gonna close this door. We've got a set of wires connecting these two from those terminals right there. And we're gonna have Mason uh, crank that phone, which is gonna make this phone ring. And then Mr. Logan here is gonna talk back and forth because he knows how to use this now that we've spent some time on him. So I'm gonna close this door and let's give these old awesome antiques a try. Okay, here we go. go let it, leave it there so we can hang, ring you. Go ahead. Okay, go ahead. Hey, Billy, so what'd you do yesterday? Derek here. <laughs> Let's sneak around here. here. You want to come with me? Come with me. All right, we're gonna sneak around here, and we're gonna we're gonna go look at what um, what Mason's doing on this side. There he is. What did you say? What did you say? <laughs> did you just say that do you know I'm kissing somebody right now? <laughs> That's hilarious. Well, that right there proves it. Phone calls haven't changed much over the years. We're always kissing somebody right now. All right, that was fun. Thanks, guys. Very cool. Thanks for sharing these awesome phones with me. And uh, just a real quick look here inside. We might as well. Because uh, nothing, uh, you don't really own something unless you've taken it apart. We do it again? Yeah. Yeah, we'll do it again in a minute. Okay, now let's take the cover off. All right, here we go. A little bit more. And, oop, I still have something not. There we go. Let's take that off. Check that beauty out. There's the um, schematic right there. Telephone set MK, set FMK2. It's got the battery information right there. And then in here, in all of its glory, there's the phone. So you can see there's the generator, which produces about 90 to 100 volts. You definitely wouldn't know it if you get shocked by it. Uh, over here is a, uh, a capacitor system that slides out. Um, very cool, part of the talk circuit. And then there's some other goodies in here, some capacitors. The battery, guess, guess what? I've got this rigged to work on a nine volt battery right there, and there it is. And, um, and that's it, that's the telephone set right there. Um, Hope you enjoyed that. Antique science. It's awesome.